So we've looked at a lot of different kinds of video switchers on this channel, and OC just created one of the most easy to use video switchers out there with simple buttons and controls. And for me, and some of the simple streams that I do, this is exactly what I need. So let me tell you all about it. Mr. Black. By the way, welcome to the channel. My name's Danny Black. I love to share with you cool gear that comes my way. If you're new here, don't be a stranger. And if you like the video switcher kind of stuff, if you like seeing this kind of cool gear, hit that like button and YouTube will keep feeding you those videos. Also, I'll put links to everything down in the description. Maybe even a coupon code, so check it out down there. All right, so this comes in from OC. This is the GhostStream M2 Dual HDMI switcher. Inside the box, you get a case with this thing, so it has a nice little hard case. It comes with an HDMI cord. It comes with a cable to connect to your computer. Now the design of this thing is pretty simple. It's very small. It has two HDMI inputs which can take a signal of 4K 60 Hertz and there's an output HDMI to go to a monitor. So if you're using HDMI 1 for like your video camera and HDMI 2 for your game console you can do that and then go out of that to your TV. Then you have the USB-C that goes to your computer and then it shows up as a video source. On the front, you have a microphone input and a line in input, and you have a headphone output. So if you're using mic one for you and line in for your game console or a mixer or something like that, for me in this setup, a lot of times I just use a main camera and an overhead camera, which you can see right there. And this makes it so simple. Let's have a look at these buttons. So starting at the bottom here, here's your source one and source two, and it's just that quick. You can switch between them like that. And then up above that, you have different effects. So you have one and two where you have uh, one source at the top, one source at the bottom, and you can even zoom out of that if you wanna see more of that like that, zoom back in. Um, you can also quickly switch it with that little switcheroo button right there, I love that. Makes it so simple. Under that you have side by side. So if you wanted one source on this side, one source on that side, and with these little expanders, you can change that just like that. So quick and easy. And then do the old switcheroo as well if you need to switch it around. It's so simple. And then you have these picture in picture buttons. So if you wanna get out of any of those things, you just press that source that you wanna just switch to. And then you go to that picture in picture and whatever source is not on the screen will automatically show up as you see right there. And with this little expander part, you can actually make it bigger to that size right there. So you can bring that in and make it super small like that. And then you have four different sides. So you can actually switch between these just like that. And whatever you save it as, so if like if I wanted to make this one about that big there, whenever I come back to that spot, it'll stay that size. So if I made that one super small right there, and then I come back to it, it stays that small. And then what I really like about this, and this happens a lot, I can just easily hit that switcheroo button right there, and then that's it, it's so simple. And if I wanna bring it down a little bit smaller or change it to this side or that side because it remembers the different sizes there. So like how cool is that? That switcheroo button just makes a huge difference and also being able to customize that a little bit more. I mean, for how small this thing is, it actually gives you a lot of options. Basically, for everything I've ever needed in a switcher for just two sources, this is great for that. And it just makes it so much faster and easier to use. And OC has a lot of really good options if you want a switcher that does a lot more. Their GoStream is really awesome. And they also have that really high quality production field monitor as well. But that's basically it. I mean, this thing's small, it's easy to use, and it's also easy to explain, which I love. So there you have it. And if you wanna see some of the other OC videos that I've done, check out these videos right here, click one of them, and uh, I'll see you there.